This is the message to Francis Ngannou and the UFC guys. Look, he wants some of this Gypsy King money. You know where to come and find it. If you want some of this Gypsy King power, I'll give it you. Anytime, anyplace, anywhere, seven days a week and twice on a Sunday, you big ugly dosser. And this one, this is a special message to my long-haired boyfriend, Drew McIntyre, who can't stop thinking about me and can't stop talking about me. Drew, you want a good idea? I'll give it you too. Any time, any place, anywhere, Drew. I'm in Las Vegas at the moment. If you want to come and fight about it, or you want to come and talk about a fight, hit me up, baby. Any time, I'll smash you like I smash your buddy, Braun Strowman. But you go down even quicker because you're a lot smaller. Just grab your bad hair, smash your face off the floor, and it's all over, Drew. Let me know when you want a piece of the furious one. And while I'm on a rant, I may as well call out one more person. A big useless dosser. Not a real fighting man, a hype job, bodybuild, crossfit, big, ugly shithouse. That's Anthony Joshua. AJ, if you're out there, let's make this fight happen, you big dosser. You big shithouse, bum dosser. And I'm going to smash your face in too. And there's not one thing you can do about it. Prove me wrong, sucker. Prove me wrong. I'm number one. Who knows? Just been thinking. Another message for AJ. AJ, if you go past three rounds with me, I'll quit in the corner. Because that's how confident I'm taking you cold out within the first two, three rounds. Out. Out like a light switch. This is another message to Eddie the Tit Hearn. Eddie, talking about me living in the hotel in Vegas, wearing the Versace shirts. Yes, I'm absolutely guilty, Eddie. I'm over here in my 6,000 square foot hotel room, uh, wearing Versace every single day. You know, if you keep sucking Canelo off, you'll be able to get a couple of these shirts yourself, mate. Or if you, uh, if you want, I can borrow you a couple. Don't worry about it. And maybe give you a little bit of swag too. Anyway, keep sucking Canelo off. And when my boy, Billy Joe Saunders, gives him an absolute boxing lesson and knocks him out, you're going to have egg on your face, pal. You're back in your wrong horse. You're back in New Mexican over the Brit. You sausage. And as for Joseph Parker, he's now an honorary gypsy. He's no more a New Zealand man. He's an honorary gypsy. He's a part of the gang. So there you go. So, yo, Gypsy King checking in from Las Vegas. I'm here with the big man, Sugar Big Daddy Hill. Or should we call you Hollywood Chugs these days? It's just, uh, Sugar Hill would be all right. You know, everybody don't need to know all that. You know, it's like, uh, it's just out of their reach. So, yeah. How's the training going, Chug? Training is going smooth, you know. Uh, just working out every day, you know. I'm better in myself. And by me better in myself, it pushes you. You know, to better yourself, you know, just keep that competitive spirit going. We have a great, uh, a great little bond going on in the gym. Everything's on fire. Um, really can't wait to to show you guys what we've been working on. Yeah, it's going to be uh, interesting. It's been a long time since, you know, seeing the Gypsy King work, seeing him do his thing. But when that time comes, it's going to be electrifying. It's going to be exciting. It's going to be all of that and dense. We're hoping it's going to be. Thank <laughs> you.